Yo, what's up guys, welcome back to my channel, my name is Mr. Lawrence and in today's video I will show you how to get all these modded outfits. I will show them in the same order as in the thumbnail. In order to make all these outfits, you will need at least $760,000. Leave a like if you enjoyed this video and subscribe with post notice to never miss any of my videos. But before we begin, check out Aurora Resupply, they provide multiple GTA services such as modded accounts, money and rank boost for all platforms. They are really fast and reliable the link will be in the description below and let's get straight into the video with this glitch you will lose all your saved outfits except for one so equip one outfit that you want to keep and then delete all your saved outfits now open your pass menu go to online and swap character Your main character on the left side has to be a male character and your second character on the right has to be a female, otherwise it won't work. If you haven't already, create a new second female character and copy the rank from your main character. Then just load into online and make way over to any clothing store. If they don't appear, find a new session and they will appear. I already made all the component outfits and we will start with the white Tron outfit from the thumbnail. First go to the accessories and make sure that your character isn't wearing earrings. Then go to gloves and equip the refuse collector gloves, number 54. Now head over to the pants, go to utility pants and purchase the cream knee pad cargos. Then come over to the tops, scroll down to work jackets and purchase the peach camo closed field, number 38. Stay in the tops, scroll down to gun running t-shirts and purchase the last one, the blue digital t-shirt. Now save this outfit in your second outfit slot and name them like I do so you won't get confused. Now go to the shoe section. Go to the boots and purchase the red cowboy boots, number 33. Now go to the pants, then to sport pants and purchase the spotted muscle pants. Make sure that you still have the same top and gloves equipped, then you can save this outfit in your third slot. For the second blue outfit, you will need to go to the pants and equip the spotted muscle pants again. Then go to the shoes, high heel boots and purchase the deluxe midnight combat boots, number 24. Now go to the tops, go to leather jackets and purchase the blue JC jacket, number 52. Stay in the top section, go to tank tops and purchase the two-tone tank. So it's this one and then go to the accessories. Go to earrings and purchase the BMW deco earrings. Save this outfit in slot number 4. You can now keep the same pants and shoes and go to the accessories. Go to gloves and go to number 32. Equip the light woodland armored gloves. You should also have these earrings equipped and then go to the tops. Go to bastiers and purchase the grey bastier, number 19. Save this outfit in slot number 5. Now we will only change the top, so go to the tops. Then to work jackets and equip the peach camel closed field, number 38. Now scroll down to tucked t-shirts and purchase the blue digital t-shirt, number 75. Your outfit should look like this and then save it in slot number 6. For the red outfit, you will first need to go to the scuba outfits and purchase the grey camo scuba. Then go to the accessories. Go to gloves and equip the light woodland armor again. Save this outfit in slot number 7. Then go to the pants, go to sport pants and equip the first one again. 
Then go to the tops, go to leather bomber jackets and purchase the blue dotted leather closed. If it's not closed, open your interaction menu, go to style and here you can close your jacket. Now while you're at it, go to style, accessories and equip the light woodland armored gloves. Then go to the shoes, go to boots and purchase the moss tech boots. Save this outfit in your next empty slot. For the third red outfit, we will only change the top again. So go to the tops, then to work jackets and equip number 38 again. Now go to tucked t-shirts and purchase number 75 once again, so the blue digital t-shirt. Save this outfit in slot number 9. For the checkerboard outfit, we will first go to the shoes. Go to high heel boots and select the deluxe midnight combat boots. Then go to the pants, go to jeans and purchase the black cropped number 38. Come over to the tops and go to sport tops. Then purchase the grey racer bag. Now make your way over to the accessories. Go to the gloves and equip the light woodland armored. Save this outfit in slot number 10. Now go to the top section. Go to sport jackets and purchase the sea green puffer jacket, number 73. Then go to the bustiers inside the top section and purchase the white lace bustier. Save this outfit in your next empty slot. Now we will make the last green outfit. First go to the pants and equip the spotted muscle sport pants. Go to the shoes, then one up to motorcycle boots and purchase the Oxblood slack boots, number 23. Now come over to the tops, scroll to t-shirts and purchase the white rolled tee, so the third one. Then go to the accessories. Go to gloves and purchase the white and green armored. Save this outfit in slot number 12. Now go to the tops again. Go to sport jackets and equip the sea green puffer jacket. Then go to gun running t-shirts and purchase the blue digital rolled tee. Now open your interaction menu, go to inventory, body armor, show armor and select heavy armor, so the green one. Save this outfit in your next empty slot. Now head over to the pants. Go to leather pants and purchase the maca ribbed, number 41. Then go to the shoes, sneakers and purchase the pink plain high tops. Now go to the tops. Then to fitted suit jackets and purchase the black boating blazer. Now open your interaction menu, go to inventory, body armor, show armor and select super heavy armor. Make sure that you have these gloves equipped and save this outfit in slot 14. You should now have these outfits, feel free to pause the video to double check. Now open your interaction menu and take the easy way out. This way the game will quick save. When you respawn, open your pause menu, go to online and start creator. Once you are in creator, create a race, then select tutorial and accept this alert.
Now open your pause menu again, go to online and choose character. Now you will need to delete your second character, so your female character. Then press circle or B to go back to story mode. When you are in story mode, go straight back to online. Once you are back in online, you will still have the outfit that you wanted to keep, so just save this outfit in slot number 20. If you did everything correctly, the other outfits are also transferred over. Now go to the deadline outfits and purchase the white deadline outfit. Now we will need to merge the modded outfits. They removed the versus missions, so you will need to bookmark the job from the pinned comment. When you bookmarked the job, you will need to restart your game so it pops up in game. If you can bookmark it for some reason, your friend can bookmark it and invite you to the job. Just make sure that the host changes the clothing setting to player saved outfits. Then he can start the job. From here, just press right on the d-pad twice and ready up. Now make your way over to your apartment. You can't see it on the map, but you should know where it's at. Now just enter your apartment. If it doesn't let you in, blow yourself up on the blue circle and when you respawn, you can enter. Now make your way over to your wardrobe. You will now need to delete the white trunk component outfits and save this outfit in slot 19. Then quit the mission through your phone. When you are back in online, you won't have your outfit yet, but now you can just equip it through your interaction menu. Now go back to the clothing store, go to the outfit section, then to the Gorka suits and purchase the dark blue Gorka suit. Now go back into the clothing merch job, change the clothing to player saved outfits and start. Now switch your outfit once to the right and ready up. When you load in, go to your apartment. Delete the first blue outfit and save this outfit in slot 18. Then quit the mission through your phone. Equip this outfit that we just saved and go to the accessories. Then to gloves and equip the race suit gloves. Go into the job, change the clothing to player saved outfits and start. Now switch your outfit twice to the right and ready up. Now go to your apartment. Delete the blue outfits and save this outfit in slot 18 again. Then leave the mission. For the red outfit, you will need to go to the biker suits in the outfit section. Then purchase the red biker suit. Go into the bookmarked job, change the clothing to player saved outfits and start. Now switch your outfit three times to the right and ready up. Now go to your apartment again. Delete the red component outfits and save this outfit in slot 17. Then leave the mission. Now you will need to go to the biker suits again over at the outfit section. This time you will need to equip the black biker suit. Now go into the job, change the clothing to player saved outfits and start. 
Now switch your outfit twice to the right and ready up. Now from here, go to your apartment. Delete the checker outfits and save this outfit in slot 16. Then leave the mission again. Now go back to the clothing store, go to the deadline outfits and purchase the green deadline outfit. Now start the job one last time, change the clothing to player saved outfits and start. Now switch your outfit three times to the right again and ready up. Delete the green component outfits and save this outfit in slot 15. Then quit the mission. You will now have all these modded outfits. Now we will finish all these outfits by adding helmets, masks and glasses. First equip the helmet that you want on your outfit. Then we will need to do the telescope glitch. You can use one over at the beach or use the one in your high end apartment or even your office. All you have to do is run by the telescope and spam right on your d-pad. If your character doesn't look into the telescope you did it correct. Now equip your modded outfit, walk away and the helmet will merge on your outfit. Now save this outfit again. Now now I will do it again, but this time with a mask to merge the mask and helmet together. I did it for all the outfits and they look pretty sick. So hopefully you enjoyed these outfits and I will catch you in the next one. Bye bye.